Hello, this is Victor at RestoryMercedes.com. This video is for Ernesto in Florida. Okay, Ernesto, so we have your TLLR module here. That's the original from the vehicle. I had the video like this showing you that it works. Just so I could, you know, when I tested it out before I repaired it. And um, your throttle body, of course. These units were on my bench for two days all about. And I'll show you the... First of all, that they do work. So as you can see, this is my power switch right here, top right corner. Activate the unit. This is your original computer. Um, I did repair this line here. As you can see, there's a bypass wire right now. And um, so that takes care of the burnt burnt section behind these these things. As you, as you remember on the previous video, I have a burnt section over there. It, it's cut off. So it doesn't short no more. This is like a little piece right, right over here. As you can see, a little part of it cut off clean. So, and this is the burnt area. You can see used to be there, cut off clean here. So no more. Um, and it by it is bypassed with the wire. So it's basically ready to go. I'm just gonna put the cover on, and um, you know, just so you know that they've been energized. This is the the thermometer. So, 78, 79, well, whatever the temperature of the room is, 76. So when you put it on the, on the unit, you can see temperatures rise, depending on which portion. Um, chips are hotter usually, and, um, you know, 114 is 120 something. Chips are usually hotter than the board, so as you can see, it is. It is on, it is warm. Same for the throttle body here. That's the more or less the hottest area around this area, somewhere around here. That's where the clutch coil and the motor is. So it's been definitely on for a long time to get it this hot. And inside, of course, they're even hotter. This is from the outer case temperature. And again, this is the room temperature, 77. So these been on for a while. And uh, basically that's that would be it. Unit works fine. As you can see it's making the noise. I'm gonna shut it down, put it back on so you can see that throttle plate moves. That's off. I'm gonna put it on. This is idle, idle speed. So this is basically your activation. Your unit, your TLLR and your throttle body. Both repaired. Okay. Um, as you can see, the, the wires are all connected together through the through my looms over here. You see, this goes up, it goes here, it goes into your module. I'm not gonna bother with the second one that you mailed me because I think if that one didn't work, that means it is not good. So you can just call the guy up and return it because you do not need it if it doesn't work. So it's probably if I'm going to start. This is the second one you mailed me. So I don't think it's gonna make sense to open it up and check it inside if and then the guy is not gonna take it back. So not a good solution I think. So we know one good working unit is gonna go back to you, and that's all you need. Um, and throttle body of course is working. Okay, well that basically covers it and um, um, I'm just gonna pack everything up and mail it back to you. I'm gonna find a couple of bolts to put the cover on. It came without bolts. Okay, this was Victor at HistoryMercedes.com. Thank you for watching.